My name's Harry, and I'm from Enon, Ohio. And, and what I'm, you got there? We're ma making uh, fillers for the diagonal supports for the ribs. And when the rivets go through this, this gives it a, a stronger bond, and they're pretty much custom fit for each uh, cross member. Eventually, this will go all the way in like so, but we need to taper this so this oval matches the oval in the rib. Okay, so that's made out of phenolic. Is this that is phenolic resin. And what are you doing here? You're sanding it down. We're we're uh, sanding it the shape down to fit. It has to go in all the way past the rivet hole and we're uh, getting it to the proper shape because the taper on here isn't 100% uh, parallel all the way. It tapers in a little bit when it gets to the main round tube. So you're trying to do it so it doesn't compress the tube, is that correct? Expand. We don't want to expand it. Oh, well, oh, oh, oh. either way it's, it's going to, yeah, it'll fill the, the gap so when the rivet goes through it gets a good bond from both sides. Okay. Now show me where that... Uh, the tube goes on the wing. Okay, this tube will mount on this last rib like so. And you've got, on this particular location, we've got six bolts because on the original design, you had gas tanks in between here and this was to uh, make, make it to access the gas tanks as opposed to being a hard rivet. So both ends of this will have bolts. All right, yeah nuts and bolts. Mm -hmm. We're on this one we have ribs or on rivets. So these are all removable with the bolts and uh, we're doing the phenolic so when the bolts go through they got a good grip and it doesn't compress the uh, uh, the tube. 